friends and welcome to this week's tarot reading with Reiki. Um, we're going to be doing the zodiac tarot readings for all 12 star signs for this week, which is the week of the 25th of November. We will uh, also be diving into three follow-up questions towards the end of this video, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that. All the timestamps for everything will be mentioned down below in the info box. So give that a read in case you want to jump right ahead. Um, don't forget to share this video with your friends because I feel like a lot of you are just watching this and not sharing this with your friends. The shares in these videos are surprisingly lesser than the other videos. But this is actually a series you should be sharing with your friends because so many of you find it super relatable um, and yeah, hopefully helpful. Mm -hmm. Let's dive right in making this intro shorter. As usual, we'll begin with Aries. Aries. Aries, the card that we have for you is the star. The star here is telling us that this is going to be a great week for you. You know, star in tarot indicates wish fulfillment. So anything sort of, you know, uh, was pending from a very long time. This is the right week for you. Go ahead, take efforts and you will see a lot of things, you know, coming in your favor. At the same time, this card also tells me uh, it, it's sort of a week where, you know, a lot of things will happen for you in terms of healing. You know, you will feel better if, if the past there were certain issues, certain problems this is this week is going to be a good week in terms of healing for you also the angel answer we have for you is big happy changes so angels here are telling us the situation is definitely in your favor you will see some major changes major positive changes that will be in your favor Taurus the card that we have for you is the ones the ones here is telling us this is a good week for you in terms of your relationship you know if if you are dating someone and you want to take that relationship to the next level go ahead do that this is going to be a great week for you you know if you're expecting some sort of complications some problems it's not going to arrive you know things are going to go really easy and smooth for you this week also people who are in relationship this is a time where you sort of make the other person feel special go ahead take that efforts Angel answer for you is peaceful resolution. The situation that you're working on right now, it's it's telling me that you know it's gonna resolve, it's gonna resolve in a peaceful manner. So you know there's there's no drama that's happening and things are gonna unfold on its own and you will sort of be very, very grateful the way it turns out for you. Gemini, the card that we have for you is judgment. This card here is telling us that you know this is a week which is very very crucial for you in terms of you know where you have to deal with a lot of people this is a week where it's telling me that you know your intuition power is really really strong you are a person who would just judge people by you know speaking to a person over the phone or just actually looking at a person you don't really need to know the person well to actually know the person so somewhere your judgment power is really really strong understand that and sort of start utilizing it in your situations angel answer for you is there's something better angels here are telling you the situation that you're working on right now you know it's it's sort of not moving forward and it's got stuck somewhere so angels are giving you a heads up saying that you know there's something better for you understand that and just sticking on to something that's not working for you isn't a good idea so go ahead and look for better options cancer the card that we have for you is the ones the ones here is telling us that you know this is a week where you're stressing a lot about work it's just like work work and work in your head which is sort of you know, not really doing well with your mental health. You have to understand that, you know, over pressurizing yourself and pushing yourself beyond the boundaries is, is not a great thing. So stop, pause, sort of, you know, relax for a while and then get back to work. Understand how do you want to take forward. So a bit of planning here is required wherein what you're doing is just slogging, slogging, slogging. So once you plan and then work accordingly, that will really help you. Angel, answer for you is don't stop. The situation that you're working on right now somewhere you know you really cannot see any outcomes and it's it's sort of stuck in a way so angels here are telling you yes yet we cannot see your outcome but the positive sign that you've got from the universe is don't stop keep working towards it and you will eventually get there leo the card that we have for you is ace of pentacles ace of pentacles here is telling us that you know this is a week where certain thing is sort of popping in into your life wherein you know a person who wants to enter your life it's just like you know you've closed all the doors and you feel like no i'm not ready for it but the card here is telling us that you will have to sort of open the doors and accept the person uh, with open arms because it's eventually beneficial for you it's sort of going to bring positivity into your life angel answer for you is it's up to you 
the situation that you're dealing with right now somewhere you know it's it's you have to take charge of it understand that when you start taking charge of a certain situation you can turn it around so somewhere you have to start manifesting it understand what you want be clear with your vision and it's just going to turn the way you want Virgo the card that we have for you is temperance temperance here is telling us this is a week where you need to balance a lot of things in life somewhere you know you focusing only on work and not sort of giving time to your family this is a week where you will have to find that balance everything around looks good you know you are very happy what you're doing right now but eventually people around you aren't really happy you need to take that effort and go and sort of give quality time to people around because it's just telling you that you know you need to have a certain balance in your life right now angel answer for you is abundance this card here is telling us the situation you know you are working with right now has a lot of doors open for you you have to understand that everything that's coming your way is in abundance it's it's sort of a very bright and a positive sign once you start acknowledging that you know things are going to turn in your favor Libra the card that we have for you is Ace of Swords. Ace of Swords here is telling us, you know, this is a week where you have to be very very clear with your words. You know, your communication has to be really really good. Anything that you're dealing with don't use any harsh words because it's eventually going to affect a lot of people around you which is eventually going to affect you. So somewhere you have to be very very careful with your words this week. Also this is giving me a sign that you know somewhere this is a week where you'll be very very sort of particular about a lot of things which is eventually going to create uh, trouble for people around you but this is not something that you have to change go ahead in the same direction. Also the angel answer for you here is no. the situation that you're dealing with right now does not have a outcome you know it's not working in your favor so understand that when you you know sort of leave that and walk forward in life you will see some better things in front of you but as of now cards have a very clear answer for you which is a no scorpio the card that we have for you is the card of pentacles this card here is telling us that you know you're holding on to situations very tightly it feels like you know everything that you're dealing with this particular week it's it's just directly affecting your mind you know it's not giving you that peace of mind that you require so somewhere you're being very very possessive about people about things so somewhere when it doesn't come to you in return you feel very very disappointed so cards here have a advice for you saying that you know loosen up the situations don't take everything to your head you know eventually it's going to unfold in its own way angel answer for you here is remain positive angels are telling you the situation that you're dealing with right now you know requires a lot of affirmations require a lot of positivity from you because somewhere you've started using a uh, sort of negative words a lot of noes and you know it's never going to happen all of this when you start turning those words into yes and always only then things will sort of turn your way so this is a uh, sort of a shout out from the card saying that start affirming and you know remain positive towards that situation Sagittarius the card that we have for you is card of cups this card here is telling us this is going to be a great week for you somewhere you know it calls for celebration it calls for success you know meeting people that you haven't sort of seen in a long time and you know getting that bond all over again this is a time where cards are you know sort of uh, telling you that you need to spend quality time with people around angel answer for you is wait angels here are telling you the situation is still not you know at at a conclusion it's still sort of working its way out you have to understand that it's just a phase you know it's just a time you really cannot do much about it's it's just the time where you have to have that patience and wait capricorn the card that we have for you is chariot this card here is telling us that you know any situation that that sort of requires a decision from you this particular week understand that you know it has to have a balance between your heart and mind somewhere you have to i know you will be like you know what does that even mean so somewhere there has to be a balance you have to sort of satisfy the practicality of it at the same time you have to sort of look at if you are very convinced about it your heart really wants it so somewhere you have to figure a middle way working only through your head or only through your heart isn't really going to help you so understand that this is going to be a crucial week in terms of any decision that you want to make but it has to have a balance between your head and heart angel answer for you is a year from now so angels are telling you the situation that you're working on 
isn't really uh, very close to conclusion you know things are not really turning the way you want them to so somewhere it's it's going to take a little more longer time than you expected to uh, uh, as per what cards are saying a year from now so somewhere you have to still work towards it to actually get there aquarius the card that we have for you is justice justice here is telling us that somewhere you know you've knocked the right door you know this is a week where where if you're looking forward to something and you know want to get to a conclusion justice is going to be there by your side and you know whatever you're feeling from heart it's actually going to work out for you so this is going to be a great week for you uh angel answer for you is that something better the situation that you were seeking answer for is is really not turning the way you want them to turn out for you so somewhere it's it's requesting you to look at better things in life look at different aspects of it and then probably you will you will actually come to a conclusion and understand that this is something very better for you pisces the card that we have for you is the devil the devil here is telling us that somewhere you know people around you are sort of going to demotivate you to a extent where it's actually going to get in your head and you will start thinking in a lot negative way you will start sort of you know doubting yourself and your self confidence will actually be nowhere so understand that this is a important week for you don't get sort of singled into what people say just keep up with your good spirits and use positive words uh, angel answer for you is take action angels are telling you you know a lot of planning and all of that is done to the situation right now you need to take one step forward understand that this is a time which requires action and when you put that action into actually uh, the situation you will see it turning it in your favor this so now that we're done with all the star signs i'm going to pull out the questions that we have Okay, so the first question we have for this video is from Niharika Goba. Hi, Anam, I really need your help. This is my sixth attempt for the CA final since year 2016. Please help me. I am unable to get when is this going to end and when and I'm and will success and will success finally come to me? My exams started from 1st of November 2018 and are on till the 9th of November. Please help me with this. My date of birth is fifth of November, nineteen ninety-four. Belated happy birthday! Um, as tomorrow is my birthday, please give me a gift by answering the question. Okay, so that's basis when she posted the question. Okay, what do we have for her? We pull out one angel answer. The angel answer that we have for you is if you believe. So somewhere, yes, like you mentioned, you know, it was sort of a struggle, and you didn't really clear your CA. but this is a time where you have to work hard at the same time believe in it you have to understand that you know it has to have a balance somewhere when you start affirming and you know have that positive mindset saying that yes i will clear it i am going to clear it and then you will see results coming your way so this is a good sign for you i'm going to give a quick mention to rikki's instagram over here because she does a lot of really good positive affirmations on her instagram profile so make sure you guys go take a look if looking for affirmations and needing affirmations is something that you identify with The next question I have for today's video is from Ravina two eight zero seven. Her date of birth is the twenty eighth of July nineteen ninety two. She wants to know about her career and about her marriage. Okay, we're gonna pull out two tarot cards for her. The card in terms of uh, career, we have a card of wands. This card here is telling us that at the moment career is not going the way you want it to turn out for you. So somewhere there are struggles, there are a lot of problems that you're facing with in terms of your career. So the advice here for you is figure. figure out what you want understand that taking one step at a time will help you because right now you're jumping into a lot of things and you're sort of messing around with your own situation so go easy take one step at a time and you will figure out things for yourself whereas your marriage is concerned this is a card of pentacles it's it's telling me you know things are good for you things are going positive for you but somewhere you know you feel you're not very prepared for it which is why you're walking post it so understand that you know you'll have to stop to every opportunity that's coming your way and then you know look into it if you want to take this forward or not what you're doing right now is just walking by it don't do that okay the third and the last question for this video is from kanishka anand her question is well her date of birth is the 10th of april 2000 what is the best career line for me to go with okay we pull out three tarot cards here for you This is the first card that we have for you. The card of Pentacles. Second is the Fool, and the third card is a Cups. So all these three cards indicate that 
something that has to relate with creativity at the same time something in the fashion industry will really really help you out so anything that you know you you feel if you're good at in the fashion industry go ahead and try that that's actually going to favor you sorry just out of curiosity how do we come to fashion industry from these cards uh, these are the cards of creativity at the same time you know everything is there on her platter right now it it says that her interest is there in the fashion industry so somewhere you know you haven't really given that much thought it's it's the time where you take things forward i hope that we've been able to help you guys with all of your questions answers and weekly readings make sure you guys go check out rinki's channel and reach out to her for private readings if that's something you absolutely looking at all the details are down below in the info box we will see you guys in the next video bye